What's going on? What's going on? Brutus here with your next Ninja Live video. Uh, for this one, let's go ahead and take a look. Up against the Dark Knights in round three of the Clan War League. So far, they have uh, used three attacks. One Town Hall 3 triple. The rest were doubles. Asterix cleared. Jake the Rake singled. So, we're going to hang out. And we're going to hopefully get some Town Hall 9 action before the next couple hours here. So hang tight. I'm going to go into the shadows and see if I can't catch an initial lie. Ah, I got one. Oh, snap, son. <laughs> we got Savage Ferdy going in. What's funny is that I was actually looking at this base uh, to fill out something. Oh, whatever. It doesn't even matter where I was looking at this base. But, Savage, you're hitting a base I was literally looking at. <laughs> um, here we are, Ninja Live. Going to do a walk here. It looks like he's going to try to get a... It looks like he's going to try to get a closed walk here. Obviously, an air attack. Queen of... Su a charge of some kind because of the three rages. I don't know what's in the CC. No way to jump through. How is he going to get these air defenses? Queen's done. Opens up the wall. Okay. Looks like his queen charge is going to get one of those air defenses. Got the queen out. Now he's got to deal with the CC next. Ooh, nice baby dragon for the funnel on this. 16 loons. He's probably going to get... She's going to step up. That was nice. The wall, double wall breaker. If you know, um, to open up the wall, she'll step up to get this air defense or that air defense. Either or, it's not covering the, th the um, third one there, so he'll be safely lalooning. He's probably got a max hound in the CC and going to use two hounds, um, two hounds and 16 loons to laloon the rest. Here it starts with the haste to zoom in. Is he just going to get that trade? Oh, I don't know if that was smart. Yeah. Maybe fat fingered the hound. Queen still got ability though. One of the um, one of the um, air defenses is down, so this is still looking pretty good. But that Tesla farm next to the BK might pose an issue. Holding on to that rage, still really going to use it for the queen. She'll bank through this wall, and she, this is oh time is going to be the issue now. We'll zoom back out. Got a troll Tesla on the far right. This is going to be close. All the ADs are down, so he's got this um, hound uh, to tank for his loons as they go to this Tesla farm. That's really good for him. Minions on the left to clean up the trash. Uses the queen's ability uh, to get that BK. There goes that last hound. Oh my gosh, this is going to be close. So he's got a wall. <laughs> he's got a lot of loons. <laughs> He's got a lot of loons heading into uh, that Troll Tesla. Twenty seven. He's got this. This is going to be a three. Woo! Good opener. That's the first hit, uh, to my knowledge. First hit from One Hive uh, from our side of the war in this um, Clan Boy League round two. Nice. Woo! Ah! Skeet, 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 skeet. Get that elusive, elusive uh, B whale. All right, so we're back out of here. Nice job, nice job. Well, we'll go back into the shadows and uh, see if we can't catch another one. Hang tight. Get in there. Woo! What is this? What is this? We got Quay going in here with an AQ walk. Man, I've been waiting like a freaking hour and a half in the shadows for this thing. Holy crap. AQ walk on the left here. Going to walk it down towards the right, giving the baby dragon placement. Kind of a high risk here because he's going to have the sweeper blowing into him. One drag. One drag uh, to uh, bring the CC out. Nice funnel formed. Rage down. Poison down. Hopefully you can save the ability. Looks like he will, because that poison and rage down was, was down early. Really important for those things. Plus, as he encounters the BK here with the rage behind it, uh, make sure that... Uh, plus, the BK was also being... Uh, uh, damage was being mitigated from the poison. Um, 
He's still able to save that high, uh, really important there ability. Looks like he's got a, a double jump Vaho, Queen Walk double jump Vaho. Uses the other Rage to push through downward. Let's see what's the action down here. Jump in. It's going to be close, man. It's real. Oh, it's already walking towards the right. <sighs> Golem's going to not join the kill squad. Hopefully, he can still salvage this up. Bowlers are in there, though. That's good. That's promising. Queen is taking a lot of heat from that 90, uh, 90 DPS X-Bow. She's going to have to pop that ability pretty quick here. Maybe not. Queen is down. He's still got 11 hogs left. Going to lose the healers on this. That Queen is still on that. Uh, that X-Bow is still on the Queen. He's going to have to use the ability now. Now the bow is on the Golem. He's got another Golem in the south here that is just hanging on a wall, which is really unfortunate. Hogs coming through shortly here. Oh, you got a little, let's zoom out a little bit so you can see all the hog deployments coming around. It's really unfortunate about these golems. Really patient on Quay's part here. Try as long as that. If he can get this queen, don't target the queen. Ha <laughs> ha, no, stay up, queen. You're the best cleanup troop there is. That's really impro promising right here. This might still have enough chance. He still might do it because that golem <laughs> is stuck on that wall. He's got enough. I don't know. That queen. Uh, is still behind everything that's in front of her, which is really promising. Oh my gosh, if I get this. Woo! Nothing on the corners. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Oh, it's going to come down to this. Oh, go, Hoggies. Go. <laughs> no! Hoggies. Oh, get it down. Get it down. Go. Go, 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 go. Shoot it. Oh my god. Woo! Ah, skit, 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 skit. Let's get that. Let's get that elusive B whale out of here. Oh yeah. Let's see if there's any. Oh, we got another one. Rapid fire, rapid fire. Got rage going in. Oh man, waiting in the shadows, ever so quietly, cause we're hunting three stars. Hating in the shadows here for like an hour and a half, almost two hours. Actually, yeah, two freaking hours in the shadows waiting for some action here. Oh, man. All right, so a Queen Walk here is going to do another Vaho. Queen Walk coming around. That's looking okay. Under the Rage, she'll take care of at least one point defense. Be able to catch back up with that gentle breeze of the Sweeper. Pushing the uh, Sweepers out of range of air defenses would actually help some a ton. This looks like a... <laughs> Didn't even realize it was a Town Hall 10 Scout, but that's okay. The Scout's looking pretty good. Um, what established from here, this looks like a pretty good walk uh, in order to get on the long way around and get the Infernal. Actually, looking at the way things were broken down here, I you know we didn't see the opener. I'm hard-pressed to believe that maybe... No, 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 maybe not. Uh, maybe that wasn't the walk that he wanted, but promising, you know, really good entry on this for uh, a Scout. Got the Queen with the Valkyries. Imagine if you had one more heal in the bag for a Town Hall 10 uh, and then higher troops. With one heal for right in this uh, in this section here, maybe this spell comp might need to be adjusted with a, a heal and freeze. I'm assuming that it went according to plan, but really nice walk. Let's back out of here. I apologize. I thought that was um, rapid fire. However, we're catching some good ones here, so I'm going to go back. Uh, hopefully, we'll, uh, everyone's waking up here to put in their um, their attempts. Halfway through uh, through the war, uh, it's 36 to 49. However, um, long story short, the dips uh, have been started, and both posturing uh, strategy has, been, has taken place, where they're uh, leaving some Town Hall 9s for 10s to dip down fresh, or just to clean them up, really. At the end of the day, uh, after the Town Hall 9 game is really all said and done, for both sides, each side's going to need a dip. However, um, there was about four to five extra Town Hall 9 attacks on one hive side, being really cautious and coming together about what plans need to work and collectively as a group is, uh, is how we started out the war. Uh, enough said on that. I'll go back into the shadows here and hopefully we can catch another ninja live. Hang tight. Oh, we got another one. We got another one. Ooh, dipping up. 
Ton all 10 via Ton all 11. Helms Deep going in on the number four spot. Looks like he's got a BK tanking for the queen. She's going to get one of those air defenses at least. Zach Quakes the other two. And the BK cleared away a lot of trash ring. No doubt she'll be done right after that, though, after the ability. That's that. So, what did I miss? Oh, he zapped. No, what did I miss? What did he zap? I missed it. He must have zapped the... Was trying to get the queen? Were we trying to get the queen on the zap? I don't know. I missed that part. But three air defense is still up. Clearing the uh, basically clearing, leaving the last two that are not covering the uh, town hall. Queen lift in the middle. She should at, uh, suck in those dragons once they get into within her ring. Right there, they're going to reroute and go straight for her. As soon as they're done with the CC, there they go. Once they get inside that ring, everybody reroute to the, once they're done with their structure, there goes, there's the 50%. Nice job. Uh, everything else is just gravy. This thing on the right, this dragon on the right is going to give them at least up into the 60s, depending on healthy, yep, fully healthy dragon. Oh, hey, been on, been on this game a little bit too long. Sorry about that. Um, yeah, going to get at least, looks like a 59%. Respectable. Wait, one more, one more breath. There it is, 60%. Nice job. Woo! GG. Nice deuce up top. We'll come out of here. Oh, we got another rapid fire. Let's get in here. They ch Ah, Asterix tried to sneak in and army. <laughs> I've been waiting for Asterix. All right, so we got Asterix coming in on this. Been planning it all morning. Look at that baby dragon up here at the top. Poison down for this uh, for the queen. This is a cleanup attack. This trick was actually used by uh, the attacker before this. Two dragons at the top. So it's kind of like the same thing for one dragon aggroing the queen, but for the cost of a spell. Two baby dragons gets the queen out of the picture pretty cheaply and smart because sometimes that uh, max dragon may not keep up with it. And if there's a black Sam up there, the, then that dragon just won't work. But if you have two of them, uh, one of the baby dragons soaks up any potential bombs up there. Really smart. Queen on the bottom, bowlers um, wrecking face down there. Stu has a heal in the bag. He, he no doubt should use right around here. Bowler cleaning, minions up top. Piggies can fly. Oh, there's that. He's going to have to put that down to heal those. There it is. Oh, he lost. Oh, he missed that heal. Can't heal dead hoggies. It looked so good if you would have dropped that heal right at that hut area. But those hogs would have survived. Man, we were on a roll here catching all of them. Um, still got a lot of time left because these minions will get over here to get that hut. Um, really being patient. Going to use that ability when necessary. She'll step up into that stuff. Still a lot of time. If these minions don't hit a Sam, he should still be okay. Uses the ability because he's got to shoot through a lot here. Plus, there's a high hit point storage. If that goes down and then the final point defense, he should be okay with this. Anything in the corners? Nothing in the corners. It's all about this right here in the middle. Can she beat through this wall of a wall? A Sam took out three minions. Oh, my gosh. Oh, it's going to be quick. It's going to be close, rather. I don't think there's enough time. Really, the demise of this is that heal was, was too late. Great plan, Asterix. Sorry that work out. Maybe he was planning for it around this Tesla farm uh, with that GB right in between it by the Wizard Tower. Good try. This was a 99% as we back out of here. Uh, before that, let's take a look on number 17. It already was a 99% with Hunter. Um, man, good try. Good try, bud. So, whoop. Whoop, we got another one. Looks like a scout going up. And then this will be the video as long as we don't have another rapid fire. D-Cell fire. testing out an opener for this one. Walk on the bottom. Going to take out the queen with that engagement, no doubt, because no matter which way she goes, she's going to hug the wall. Hence why the early, <coughs> excuse me, poison down to help mitigate the DPS coming at the queen. <coughs> excuse me, from the BK. Um, there's a chance she'll aggro onto the queen when she hugs the wall, going down to the right side, which is where she'll head. Where, where she will head. 
And he'll face one point defense, actually zero point defense. As long as that queen steps up into that ring, there it is. Probably going to pop the ability at this point. Pop it. There it is. Queen is done. And then she'll be healed back up with the healers right behind that. CC Lore, really promising opening. This is really, really good opening for a Town Hall 10 to build upon this. Jump to the right, obviously with the hobo. The bowlers would erase everything on the left on the bounce. Or the queen would help take, take part of that, forming uh, an L shape as they get towards that infernal tower. BK will get that. Good information on the traps. Yeah, this actually looks pretty promising. So then the heal and the and the uh, he, heal and freeze for the back end infernal with the town hall ten beginning of that. Not bad, not bad at all. Really good opener information. Um, still got the hogs left over, so you can see that pathing. Obviously, with a stronger. Oop, you got another one. Oh no, that's the same one. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't want to miss them. <laughs> Uh, good, a good, good opener tested right there. Really unfortunate for uh, Asterix with a uh, heal that was held a little bit too long. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the Ninja Live videos. Um, I'll co I'll come back and try to put together the last thirty minute video like we did last time. Once again, it's Brutus reminding you you got to be better than a double. And